Come with me to Trader Joe's and save this post. Here's what I'm loving for fall. Number one, their pumpkin butter is delicious. It is perfect to spread on toast or add to your oatmeal. But I also have my own recipe on the blog. Number two, their pumpkin granola bark is back this year. It's organic and it's the perfect sweet treat. Number three, I'm giving this beautiful pasta a try. It is colored with vegetables, so I'm all about it. Number four, the mini gnocchi are just adorable. I can't wait to make them for my kids. Next up, the gluten-free pumpkin ravioli are back. They're a little more indulgent, but very good. Number six, I really love the red pepper and almond pesto sauce, but I can create a similar recipe at home. And whatever you do, do not forget to stock up on canned pumpkin. Tis the season to make all the pumpkin things and it's only $2.49 a can. And while we're at it, don't forget to pick up tahini so you can make my cookies. Number nine, I'm gonna tell you right now, the chicken soup dumplings are worth the indulgence. Now we are getting away from all the fall things, but no trip to Trader Joe's is complete without buying a boatload of chili and lime chips. If you know, you know. Number 11, if you're like me and you hate peeling or chopping ginger, especially if you make my morning glow up tonic, buy these. The work is already done for you. Number 12, I shared these last time, but the grilled green olives are so good, you're gonna eat the entire jar. Number 13, I can't live without the garlic spread. Put it on meat, veggies, and eat it straight from the container. I love the coconut aminos from Trader Joe's. It is cheapest here and the perfect gluten-free replacement to soy sauce. For breads, I love the sprouted wheat sourdough because it's nice and hearty. In a pinch, I grab the organic chicken breast. The ingredients are only chicken and salt. Number 17. If you need snacks to keep in your purse, try the marinated artichoke hearts or the olives. They're so yummy. And of course, chomps are always a great snack on the go. I'm also loving this oatmeal. There's no sugar. And it contains flax, quinoa, and chia. Number 20. If you're feeling snacky, try the new pretzel breadsticks. I hope this was helpful. Comment your favorite thing and follow for more ideas.